Hey guys, so I just want to do a quick little hammer drop comparison test here with the iPhone 7 on the left and the Galaxy S7. We're going to drop a hammer on both devices to see uh, which one handles it better. Uh, so obviously this is a fully working iPhone 7 as you can see uh, with the force touch home button, very nice. Uh, and we do have a fully working Galaxy S7 here. Uh, which has a Gorilla Glass 4 apparently, so uh, quite uh, good protection. I'm going to start with the iPhone 7 here, so we're going to go from about, uh, shall we say, 4 feet. That's a good starting point. So I'm kneeled down here, not that high, and let's... So... I made a satisfying crunch, but did it actually do anything? No. So very good here, past the first test. And we do have the S7 up next. Four feet, kneeled, kneeled on my knees. Let's go. And do we have anything? No. So both of them pass the four feet test. Uh, we're going to stand up a little bit here and go a bit higher. So this is, I think, about six or seven feet. You know I am with my measurements. I don't really know. So let's see this one. And you can see, still very good. No marks, no nothing. Fantastic. So again, S7, standing up a little bit and crouch down. And let's go. Oh, you can see, wow. So the hammer is about, I think, one kilogram. So it's not a, not a lightweight hammer. Still no break on the back, because that's you know something you need to watch out for with glass phones. So I'm standing fully here now. And we're going to see if we can line this up. <laughs> And uh, three, two, one. Oh, I turned it around. Still nothing. Wow. Nice. Home button still works. Uh, next up, we have the Samsung representative. So I'm fully stood up here. See if I can zoom in a little bit. Because, you know, we do want to see the destruction. So fully stood up, lining it up. And. Oh. Do we have anything? We don't have nothing. <laughs> Seriously, I'm quite surprised actually. Wow. These are tough phones nowadays. So, I'm going to raise the hammer a little bit now above my head. So, it's really high. So, can we see that? And. I need to line this up perfectly. I don't know if I'm going to be able to break these actually. So let's. Oh. Wow. Are you joking me? Still. Look at that. What is this made of? Crazy. So iPhone 7 takes nearly the highest drop there. Nice. 
Can S7 perform as well? So we're going really high here. As high as I can go nearly. Oh, are you joking me? Seriously? Wow. Look at that. That is a very tough phone. Okay, one more. I think the, the last one is like the highest I can go with this particular hammer. I think I did this before and the iPhone SC couldn't take it. So, very high here. Highest I can go. Hammer's literally above my head. Three, two, one. So he did a flip then, but I can't see nothing still. Is that a mark? Just a mark. I don't think it's any damage. Wow. Crazy, crazy stuff. And again, so hammer above my head, three, two, one. So I seriously don't think I can break these actually. I mean, seriously, what are they made of? Kryptonite, fantastic performance from both of them. Uh, so yeah, you know, I think uh, I can't really go any higher with this hammer. Uh, both of them seem to have passed the test here. Uh, I'll probably uh, do a drop test as well for those of you who want to see that between them, see, you know, how they compare there. Uh, but just a quick little video here, checking out the hammer durability. Very uh, satisfied that these are very tough phones. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.